got lucky, buddy. Hey, Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This bar and hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant! Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, duh. I love it! I, I gotta remember to write that down. <laughs> and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andres, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa! Pure magic. They should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so, well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. My career depends on this. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. See, there you go, Dave. You can teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S., Covington Supplies, off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet Federal ain't on the deed. That's so. And we all like our Federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride to the taxpayer? I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. Now, Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that, so we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. 
real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great! And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Yeah, I wonder how controllable and discreet he'll be when he sees the guy who killed me and put Brad in jail. Maybe I'll hang back. Yeah, that might be a good idea. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. Well, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us spring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. All right, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. Sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happens. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad. Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me amused, I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pact. The access point is on the west side of the tower. Get us in position so I can rappel down. You fuck around while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. Yeah. so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside. Get the loop. What the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, you use a little backup here. Get me the safety team. I'm not finished with Mr. K. Hey. 36 flow. I've got it. We are not. Mikey, that's unfinished business. Clean it up. 
Where are we? We go easy on him. Thank you. Oh, why you saved me? Hey, hey. No, huh? No, 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 no. Hey, hey, I said easy. Oh, come on, give the guy a break. Oh. I'm gonna get out of this shit. Ha-ha! In bed with the Bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, uh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Jerry, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. Tracy, I love you, but you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. You
Keep on going, dog. You hear me? Hey! Oh, I ain't see shit. Yo, my bad, my bad. Sorry. Ain't seen you in forever. Hey, what's up with you? Hey, honey! What? Why you ain't pick up when I call? Nah, don't you step foot in this yard! Why? It's half my house. Now, I'm gonna call the police. For what? Disloyalty, boy. Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy. Yo, you ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old men, ignoring your homies, acting all superior? Your mama would turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbang? Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Here, darling, why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is this seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy, the boys. What? I'm fucking new in town, I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Oh, come on, man. man. What is this? Man, just come on. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. Back in kill. See the truth is, they wanna know how close me, Dre, and Snoop is, or how to shoot fish when they choose this to be Tupac. But you, I give two shits back. Shit up. The motherfuckers, I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Nothing's real in this town, nigga. Particularly when you and stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh! First rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. This the homie house right here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, all right? Now get the fuck out my way, man. Your families are so lame, we recognize you, bitches. Already knowing, low. Hey, be on point, this fool janky. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now, you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me the, give me the back! Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key? Or a fucking ounce! Man, that's motherfucking drywall! Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here! Damn, you can't fucking hustle a hustler! Fuck ah. Oh, you motherfuckers are dead! We gotta get off, bro! I back oh. down! Fuck! They brought the van! We on foot now! Ah. 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 Get the fuck out of here!
Hey, I need a cab. Appreciate it. by yellow journalism. So I take it I can count on your attendance, friend. Huh? At the smoke-in. We're what? Yeah, we're gonna bring down the government by smoking weed together in a public place. It's very effective. I'm prepared to be a martyr, friend. Are you? Shit, if being a martyr means to smoke good weed, for sure. Would you like a little warm-up? You know, before you go and collect the supplies? Before I what? You know, get the supplies. Can't have a smoke in without smoke. <laughs> you know, cerebral stuff that's gonna get the people up off their feet protesting. Man, I don't know. It sounds kind of bullshit to me. You know, we're gonna crush them with our resolve. Here. <clears throat> have a little taste of that. <clears throat> It's just a mellow, sophisticated high. Man, it seems a little dry. Can't you see the aliens? Man, what else are you taking? Man, this shit is garbage. Anyway, just get the stuff. It's a revolution, and then call me. Crazy motherfucker.
Ooh, too close. Would you stop doing this shit? Oh, oh, it's you. Yeah, how's it going, homie? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, uh, you seem incredible lately. Yeah, Trevor Phillips, but I thought if you want a picture of him. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wasn't he uh, in, in, in the, the men's room? Nah, nah. Oh, shit. I gotta tell you. This is unbelievable. Ah, crap. That hurt. Man, you're not gonna believe this. They want to do a reality series about me. Yeah, it's true, man. I'm gonna be big. I'm gonna be huge, right? It's all about the incredibly glamorous life I lead, huh? Uh, good. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, boy. Yeah, except, you know, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna need somebody else to take some shots for me. No, no I'm cool on that, dog. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, homie. Like, all right, look, this, if, if you get a chance, right? I mean, there's no rush, okay? Oh, and you know what I'll do is I'll, I'll send you a list of names and some links so you can see who they are, right? Yeah, well, whatever, man. All right. Excellent. Yeah. Hey, you know, and I promise you, fame won't change me one bit. Yeah, I was afraid you would say that. Ah! Oof! Ah! Uh, I'm good! I'm good! I'm okay! Wow, everything's good! Ah!
log 8-9 zeta 3x. Wait. Wait, wait! Stop! What's the problem, homie? Wait. Carbon-based life form. Check. Six feet tall. Check. Slightly excessive adipose tissue. Normal distribution. Check. Readings are... Readings are... Shoot. This little machine is broken again. Check. Star date 14-9-305. Time is... 789 past the ninth meridian. We are clear. Whew. Greetings, CBL. Carbon-based life form. Greetings, home. Have you seen them, CBL? Seen who? I don't know. They came to me last week. There was a brilliant joy and a terrible confusion. And they were laughing and screaming and crying all at once. And some said, Omega, we come in peace. And others said, we have come to enslave you. We are an infinitely intelligent race of super cosmic beings. And out of the six billion people on this planet, we have chosen you for no good reason. And just then they were about to abduct me and do experiments on me when their ship crashed. Man, you done lost your motherfucking mind. And now, I've got to find the pieces. Man, bullshit. Look, look. See this? Hmm? If you see some, if you see some, let me know. Yeah, yeah, okay, I will, man. Resuming data scan. What a freak. The Santa. Slow down, what's up? Yeah, Agent Douchebag. Hey, that poor son of a bitch we grabbed for you still breathing? No problems here. Sorry. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. Taking a dump? Ah, why do you care, huh? The fuck is wrong with you? Uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know, nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. You see his face that last time I popped him. <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you, you, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston? 
is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> you, mm -hmm. where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, Paul, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the slick bastard away from me. No, no, no. no. Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. Huh? It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know, I already told nothing. Nothing, I don't know anything. Please, please. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. No? no. You're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. What did you tell them? And what did they tell you? I hmm? Told I told them what I tell you. Uh-huh. What? Hey, this whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 Cause I'm tired of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. Wait, wait. No, you get to work, and uh, I'm not here. The guy's your neighbor, Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. Boss, the more I like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo -hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking Damn. scores again. The Los Santos reboot. Damn. Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent 10 years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sick bed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away, the second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers, I was on the evening news, the man who killed Michael Town. This is bullshit. This place? Davey, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't want to silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Cut. Uh, hey, you want a coffee? Can I get you anything? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. 
Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Uh, wait! What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No! Who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh, man? Huh, please, look at me, please. Sparky, Sparky! Not that! No, come on, please! No, no, no! Don't zap me! Not that! <laughs> Shit, please! Not that! So tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of them. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. There are more eyes on that town than they need. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Town. The trainee's right, and it's a good exercise. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. This'll do. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. I tell what? you what you Loosen want him to up. Know. No, please. He don't look loose to me. Are they still alive? My teeth are perfect. Not the flyers. Oh, well, you ain't gonna be chewing steak anytime soon. I don't want to get out of here. Hey, 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 hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk. It's the day I got kidnapped. This thing That's what we were afraid of. So, yeah, 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 yeah. This guy we're after. What does he look like? I was built. I was like middle age. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark. Okay, he's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? We're live. 
You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. What's one look like? They look Eastern. I had this town looks Eastern, Davy. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now, I got a racquetball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <laughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> Let's go, come on. Wait a second, Mr. Mitsu... Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. Oh, fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. I mean, you got a flight to catch, okay? Get you to the airport. Oh, safety first. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 you have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling light at it. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. Departures. No one drives me to the airport. That's good. Me. Uh. Run. You're free. Oh, what? But my family's here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? And look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. 